Hi, I'm Tori Quisling, clairvoyant and RTT hypnotherapist and Mind Hypnosis. I'm here to talk about five steps to attract or update your true love now. Many of my clients come to me for help in finding their ideal soulmate or to improve their current relationship. And what we learn through our sessions, clairvoyant sessions, hypnotherapy sessions, is that we choose our intimate partners because of our current needs. As we evolve and grow, our needs can change and so can our feelings about our relationships. And so can also our feelings about who we choose for our next relationship. Often our initial needs in a partner are to attract what's familiar, meaning from our family. We may need to heal our childhood drama or play out our parents' relationship stories. Like when we're children, we see what goes wrong in our rela the parents' relationship and we wanna fix it. So when we're an adult, we make the same scenario and try to fix that. And often we find when we do these sessions is that the current relationship or previous relationships were very similar to the ones that your parents had. And when we don't recognize this, we can feel stuck and have difficulty moving on. And so as you learn, you can grow. You can grow and learn about yourself. You can release these old beliefs at any age and attract your ideal soulmate for who you are today. And many of my clients are able to improve their current relationship. Bring that up to date. Upgrade that. There are five steps you can take now as well as getting to getting help through clairvoyance and hypnotherapy, but there's five steps you can take now on your own. The first one is to become familiar with your own love story and really examine it. Are you living your parents' love story? Did your mom go through the same thing you're going through? Do you look for a man that's like your dad? Discover and release your limiting beliefs. Do you look for a woman who's like your mom? So start to release your limiting beliefs by being aware of what they are. Be aware of your motivations. And it's amazing how your subconscious mind knows exactly um, what your blocks are when we go into hypnotherapy. You can decide, number two, to be attracted to an unfamiliar person. Our mind always makes us see what's familiar, but once you know it's an old love story, then you can specifically look for unfamiliar partners. For example, if you tend to attract loud, bossy people, specifically look for quieter, more yielding ones. Number three, you can discover your karma or unfinished business from past lives with your current relationship or a past love that's holding you back that you keep thinking about and it keeps you from enjoying your current one or finding a new one. Past life regression is a powerful hypnotherapy technique and it allows you to finish all this old business and you can update and then create a new healthy present relationship. Number four, this is very important. It's important to understand and avoid the four types of energetic vampire games that start to we start to take on in relationships that are draining, in a manipulative relationship, one that doesn't feel fulfilling, doesn't feel healthy. We call them vampire games because they're really about energy. And if you engage in the game, then you're just going back and forth. I have another video that's just about what these games are and how best to get out of them. It's good to familiarize yourself with that. And number five, this is an important clairvoyant tool I like to share, which is you wanna think about your heart as your place of commitment. And you wanna imagine there's a temperature gauge on your heart. And you're gonna check the temperature of your heart. Your heart, the more open it is, the more the temperature gauge is at 100 degrees hot then you are saying yes, yes to something new, yes to something unfamiliar, yes that you're ready. Uh, a person whose heart is ready for commitment and is very open and ready to connect is smiling, making eye contact, getting out into the world, meeting people, connecting, 
taking risks. And so those sounds, if they sound scary to you, then it's good to check your heart and just imagine a thermometer placed over your heart, see where it's at, if it's at 30 degrees, 40 degrees, and just imagine it a hot day and it goes up to 100. Your heart opens and your heart says yes to new opportunities. So check your heart so you don't have to stay alone and feel stuck. So you can gain more insight into your personal unique love story and update your self-esteem, your vision for love and relationships. We start with a complimentary clarity session with me. Go to my website, toriquisling.com, and sign up for a complimentary clarity session and see how uh, working together can help, either through a reading, some hypnotherapy, a past life regression. Um, I have uh, packages to do all of them. If, if that's what you need, I'm here for you. So I look forward to seeing you on Zoom in a complimentary clarity session.